Five serving SAS soldiers are facing possible murder charges over the death of a suspected jihadist in Syria. Uh, now, basically, uh, the, uh, th those criticising the SAS say this man was executed in cold blood uh, and uh, therefore these people might be charged with murder. We shouldn't be charging our soldiers with murder this when they are acting yeah. in the field of conflict. Uh, meanwhile, I didn't know this. Uh, there's a massive public inquiry, a High Court public inquiry, going on into the alleged execution of 80 uh, uh, prisoners by the SAS mm. over a period of time from 20 to 2013. So what we're doing is we attack our own soldiers for them serving their country. They make do, it it's very, just very mad. difficult for our servicemen and women to do the job they're trained to do. Uh, but what alarms me about this is um, they're saying that the troops have used excessive force, should have arrested the man instead, but the soldiers, mm. uh, who are still in active duty, by the way, said that he posed a threat and intended to carry out a suicide attack. So this is one of those life-or-death situations. Is he going to blow himself up? Yeah. Is he going to kill some of our troops? What do we do? We have to yeah, intervene, yeah, yes, yeah, make yeah, a snap. Yeah decision. If then, uh, the SAS, who are some of the most elite forces in the world, I know SAS officers, and they're great men. They always have, like, amazing hierarchy about them as well, like respect and intelligence and, and they're, they're grafters. If they then think, if we have to make a snap decision in a, a war zone and we could end up with murder charges, I mean, God help us. Yeah, yeah. I mean, the point is, in, in, the, in that split second when soldiers have to make a decision, you know, it's a bit like coppers when they have to make a decision with a gun. You know, they won't always make the right decision because they've got a split second. But we have to protect them then because all they are doing is they're trying to do their jobs to the best of their ability. They're trying to defend their country. And what do we do? We take them to court and charge them with murder. This is insane. It's bad. Insane.